Okay, hello, Pete. It's the VAG Collector 101 here, and so today I am going to be showing you guys all my Lilith Pet Shop collection. Now, I am currently um, not buying Lilith Pet Shops. I just moved out of the phase, but I still keep all my Lilith Pets. And these are all from 2004, like the 2000s, okay? All from the 2000s. Oh, no, not all from the 2000s. 2004 to, like, 2008, probably. That's what I'm estimating. I don't remember what age I was when I collected the Lilith Pet Shop. And I have also, I have sold, um, three play sets. I've sold three play sets and, like, um, gotten rid or lost about four or five pets. Or three or four pets, not five. And also, I used to have the Lilith Pet Shop, um, puzzle book. It was a book of, like, crossword puzzles and word scrambles and all that. But I eventually decided to, um, I don't know what I did with it. I think I, like, donated it or something because I was already, I, I got it and then I did the entire thing in, like, two days. And then I just kept it for years and years. But I still have one of my little pet shop books right here. Anyways, so let's begin. Here is all of my little food accessories. So we have a little, um, this is like half of a hat. I think I like tore this hat apart. I don't know what happened, but it's supposed to go on like one bunny ear and then the other side on the other. Anyway, so this is from a playset and I just forgot to include it with the playset. Um, these are all from the little pop-up playsets, if you remember those. They were like these little boxes. Okay, so you would buy these little boxes and you would press, and then you would press a button and it would like push a spring and it would go pop and it or it wouldn't say pop it would just like pop up and um form into a little playset and then you it also came with these tiny tiny little pets so I have a tiny tiny little kitty a tiny tiny little birdie a tiny tiny little doggy and a um this is from a different set it's a tiny tiny crab so you can just anyways and then i also have this tree and so what you would do is you would open up the playset, you would hit the thing, and it would go boop, and it would pop up. So then um, there was always a little place to put your pets in the playset. And then um, the playset, all around the playset, would have little holes like this. So you would just take the little pets and put them in the holes, and then you could, like, make little scenes and stuff. It was really cute. And I kept mine for a long time. I just had to give them up because I had no space in my room. Anyways, but I still have, um, these three, and my little crab, of course. Like, these could be doll-sized figurines. Like, that's how small they are. They're barely a centimeter tall, I guess. I think, I don't know. But, yeah, they are really tiny. I don't think, I think they were discontinued. Probably discontinued. Anyways, I also have these two tiny little gingerbread plates which um, I use for the mini dolls. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot to include the mini doll stuff. Ah. Okay. Anyways, and then I also have two little bowls of food. Oh, can you see that? No. No, there. There. Yes. There I have two tiny little bowls of food. Each came with a different set. As well as this little half food, half water thing that came with a play set. And then, um... I'll also really quickly show you my, um, as you guys know, a big portion of these stuff, of the things that are mini doll size are from Little's Pet Shop. So, I have a little lounge chair, just like, I have a little lounge chair, or, is that on? Okay. A little lounge chair where you can just put pets and they can just chillax, which I use for the mini dolls, but, um, not that often because it's a bit out of proportion. And then I also have this little sand castle and it's got a little magnet thing on it. So that what you do is you do this and then you take a pet like uh let's just take the turtle for example. And then he has a magnet on his little um foot. So he has a magnet on there, you place it on this magnet and uh okay, that didn't really show well. But anyways, you place the turtle foot on this foot while the door is closed and then it pops open. I think it's meant to be used with a dog because it has a bone, so like, oh my gosh. It's kind of not working anymore. The spring's sort of like out of it. Sometimes it doesn't close. 
Sometimes it won't open. Yada yada. But it's still a really cute mini doll prop from the mini dolls. Oh. And then I have a little sand bucket, which also came with the playset, as well as the um, frisbee, which came with the same playset. And, oh yeah, and the little earmuffs, which I use for the mini dolls now, but they are supposed to fit. I, I knew I was missing something. They're supposed to fit the little doggies, so what you can do is you can just do this. Uh, let me just get them on here. And they can just wear little earmuffs. I mean, come on, tell me that isn't cute. I know they're like really old school, but still, tell me that isn't cute. Anyways, so then now we can move on to the exciting part, which is the pets. Anyways, so I um I gave away slash sold slash donated slash lost. Let's see here. Um, hmm. I'm trying to recount all of them. I believe I gave away four little pets. Um, there was one little doggy that came with a talent show set. Um, I kind of wish that I had given them that away now. There was a poodle that came with a different talent show set. It was like a stage, and it had this little thing you could press on it, and then it would like light up a little spotlight and a little barrel that the pet could stand on. It was so adorable. Anyways, and then I also had, um, a little mouse, which I completely lost. I went to get it one day to show some of the company. I was like really young, and I went to get it one day to show some people, and I just could not find it. Anyways, and then I believe I lost, I may have lost another pet. I can't remember what I was thinking of then. Anyway, so let's, um, so that means that I, um, if I were to reclaim all of my lost pets that I can remember, I would have one, two, wait, one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, I would have like 17 Lil's pets, although, um, we'll check the records in my charming journal thing that I got, which I'll show you guys in a minute. First of all, let's get some little pets. So here's a little bird. He was one of the pets that came with a sticker, and what you did, um, they had like a limited edition pet, and so you would get like little sets, um, little, little pet shop, you would get a set. And it would come with a little pet and a little sticker. And you would put all these stickers that you got from buying the pets in a little book. And so then, um, once you got all the stickers, you would mail that book in. And then you would receive a special edition um, pet, like I think I was trying to get an elephant, that you could only receive through that um, little um, program. So that was um, quite a hassle. I just didn't do it. I think I got like two of these pets. I may have sold them all, or sold the pets, or maybe I don't know. I don't remember which ones came with um, stickers and which ones didn't, or I really don't know. I don't think it was a sticker actually, it was more like just a piece of paper. Oh, no, no, it was, okay. So it wasn't a sticker, it was a um, piece of paper. It was a piece of paper and you would tape it into this little booklet. Yada yada. So, uh, that's where this came from, and my dog, my dog got a hold of it. So she has a little peg designed to go on, um, playsets that came after the magnetic playset. But, obviously, you know, I can't do that. Or, she can't go on any of the magnetic playsets. Anyways, then I have this little kitty right here. I also have this little kitty. And this little kitty, I have, I have the most cats. And this kitty, which is really hard to stand up because she always falls over because of that paw. But whenever you do get her to stand up, it's really cute. I have this bed, came from a play set. I have this sled, I got it in a little set, I can't remember which, but it's got, these three paws are magnets. So you can like, put all of your little pets on a sled and then after they are all on the sled and after they are all on the sled they can go woo woo I'm just trying to prove to you that there's magnets 
Anyways, it might be a cool mini figure prop. Or mini mini doll, sorry. I have a little turtle. He's got a heart on his shell, which I love about him. He is one of my favorites. So my few my like favorites group is this turtle, the horse, bunny, um, and probably this dog. Probably. Oh no, the mouse. The mice. Whatever. I have this dog who came with a really cool playset. He, you like wind up the playset and then you take the pet and you put the magnet on there and it starts like spinning. It was like a tree swing. It was really cool. And then this came with the playset. Yada yada. This came with that same playset. Um, it's a little cart and what the playset also had a big slide. Um, a big pink slide. And so what you would do is, you put the dog on there, there's little magnets, and you put them on the slide and he goes, whoosh, really fast. Like, I'm talking turbo fast. I also, oh, I forgot to put him in here, I'll introduce you to those guys in just a few minutes, or seconds. I have this horse, and yes, um, this, I think this also came with a set, but it is a little, um, ice skate. So little ice skate you just put it on a paw or a hoof or a foot and it's a little ice skate and then they can like ice skate I had like three other ones I think I don't know if I ever had four of them I probably did and then I lost one so I only had three and then I lost another one until I only had one so this is my horse as you can see their paint is all if you would look closely um their paint is all pretty woo because um like these are all copyrighted, like, 2007, like, 2004, so if that gives you any idea. I also have this, which is, um, I have a little sled here, and the whole entire, and it's magnetic. And then I have a little bunny. Hello. And it also has a little hat. So, I also had another hat for this bunny, which I think, I don't know, I think I, like, tore it apart. I don't know what I was doing. I guess I was, like try oh I think I was trying to fit it over um someone else's head like the horses or something I was trying to fit it over another pet's head but I think it was supposed to have another half to it but I still have my little um bunny hat <laughs> so adorable anyways and then I also I have this bed um came with a playset yada yada and I have these two little doggies which I, um, whenever I play with the Lewis Pet Shops, which is very rarely anymore, I always say, oh, they're brothers, because they look so much alike. And yes, this is, cor you are correct, this is a little, um, hat. It's a little tiny hat, and it's held on with elastics. A little tiny sun hat. Here, I'll just take it off, see what he looks like. I'm bold. No, you're not. Anyways, so the reason I keep my little pet shop is just because, one, they're very sentimental to me, you know, little toys, and two, I just really like to d admire them because they're so adorable. I really like this bed, too. The beds, anyways. And then I have these two Happy Meal figures. Um, this one, which, oh, now I know. Okay, excuse me for just a second. So, this one, it came in a little purse. Oh, gosh. We better wrap this up. So, it came in a little purse. I don't even know what this is now, but it was like a Happy Meal toy. And then this is my other Happy Meal toy. It's a little dog. And you could, like... This was a keychain. Of course, my dog got a hold of it. So then, of course, it can pop off. And, yeah. So, if I'm going to... Oh, wait. Does that say... Okay. So I think I'm going to have to wrap it up here. I'm going to make a part two because I still have one more playset to show you as well as a book and my plushies. I have a very interesting story. Come back more. What? I, I don't even know what I'm going to say. I'm just going to fly away. Fly away. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Comment, rate, like, and subscribe. Bye.